What's up, my boys? Welcome to sunny Porto. This is what we dreamed of. <laughs> but it doesn't really matter because today we're actually continuing to Tuma. We're going down south. And we are going to Rio Tejo. You know, the, the Tagus River where you have to tag us. Oh, sure. Tá tudo bem? Tudo bem? Tá tudo. It's gonna be hard to say goodbye to you today, sure. Yeah. yeah. What are we gonna do? Well, we can cry. Two hours later. At, with a little nap and Joel at the wheel and we are here in um, Almural we are going for a little cruise this is a river that goes all the way to Lisbon home in theory we could take the boat and sail home today but some places along the um, river it's uh, the water is very shallow so it really depends on whether you have a lot of water to work with today it's a high tide we've never been this far in uh, with Tejo. i mean it goes all the way to spain but yeah. we've never been in here and look at the the town over there Nice boat. Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Very good. Nice to meet you. How are you? We should talk about the boat that it is 100% solar driven. Yes. yes. What if the sun doesn't shine? The sun doesn't shine. We have batteries that uh, harness the solar energy and gets us to move around freely during hours. Hello, Hello little okay. friends. <laughs> Starting the day today with a very unique experience that we didn't know existed here in Portugal. Because today we are doing castle watching and petiscus eating from Rio Tejo inland near Tuma. Ah, okay, okay, okay. It's not bad. <laughs> that was very masculine, Amanda. Well, I'm a woman. You know. <laughs> Lambrusco is so underrated, you know. It used to be a poor man's uh, alcohol, but today it's become kind of a hip. Uh, thing to drink. Salud. Cheers, salud. It's like a champagne, more sweet, but it's not like uh, dosa. So this castle was actually built by the Temple Warriors, and it's all it dates all the way back to 1171, where the Temple Warriors they were trying to take over this area from the Moorish. So they pushed all the Moorish people from here to the other side of Rio Tejo. So this and a lot of the other uh, castles along the way were actually some of the most important defense temples that were that are for the temple knights so the temple know, knives the temple knight, knife, <laughs> knights 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 we're actually going into Tuma later because they have an amazing knife uh, collection and they have hotels where you can spend templar nights as well they also have templar night stands is that a you're boiling the soup too much Jon? they have one night templar stands right? isn't it crazy to think about you know the amount of people you know they were just tossed out of uh, the wall because they said something to the king that uh, he didn't like and this is where Braveheart took place <laughs> Ciao yeah. <laughs> ciao! And we are leaving. Obrigadinho! Vamos a comer um almoço! 
This experience was amazing. And I know that we are going to bring your parents here. I really need to bring yeah. your parents here. They're going to love it. Can you pretend you love me? Pretend you love me, mom. I have some other fantasy, hi. And then we will go to the tomar. Ah, so we are to going to the tomar. Para tomar cervezas? Para tomar something. <laughs> Carinho, eh, amor e amizade. E amizade. Yeah, não, 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 não. Carinho, carinho, saúde e amor. E amor. What does carinho even carinho, mean? Carinho, what does that mean? Carinho is uh, affection. To affection, to health and to love. So, what, so when you carinho. say, can you wait? Uh, Sum carinho. Hmm? What, when you say wait, like Sum carinho. Like when you wait, just like just a little. Ah, não, só um bocadinho. No, ra, carinho. No, no. Carinho. Só um bocadinho. Bacalhau is not that great, right? Not that great? How do you say that? Massada de bacalhau is fantastic. The day so you, have you to try a massada de alheira, you will be a fan. But okay? speak, speaking of alheira, look at this right here. <laughs> Hallelujah! You know, we just drove two hours south. Apparently you can get alheira here. And you know how I feel about alheira. I think it's... We don't want to beat the horse anymore with the alheira. <laughs> But uh, let's live up to your. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Aliena is like pizza. It's good with syrup. It's good with salt. It's good with pepper. Chocolate. It's good even if there's no music in the air. What the f are you doing? <laughs> they drove without me. They drove without me. I swear I, I heard um, I voice? heard Johan getting into the car. I swear I hear you getting into the car. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, I'm like, yeah, it's fun, it's fun. And like you keep going through the, the, the whole parking lot. <laughs> no, no, and, and I thought Emily was, was talking to you here inside. I can't even get in. I thought he was making fun. I even said it. I said, no. oh, this is fun. And then I said, maybe don't continue this far. And then he could just <laughs> say, OK, I think you have to stop. Otherwise, he, he will get annoyed. <laughs> We have to film with iPhone here because we need authorization to film with the big camera. Look at this. You know, even though they didn't have fridges and super bug and, in, and, and Wi Fi back in the day, I would have probably changed my era here on the planet 
with back then. Would you, if you were a Templar Knight back then, would you change your life today with back then? Um, I don't think so. I think so. I would rather live today where you have flushing toilets. Vamos dentro a casa. This is King Manuel's architecture, so we call it Manuelina architecture. These are the ropes. This is a symbol of the, the, the Portuguese discoveries. Yeah? So oh, they are everywhere. Like the, the boats or yes. what? Yeah. Portugal, it was the biggest rope manufactory in the world till the, the 16th century. So uh, this is one of the symbols of ships and the, you know, the richness that came with the, with the discoveries. But what was the deal with the Templars? Because I don't think we've touched on the story with the Templars. The Knight Templar is a warrior monk. They were fighting against the, the Moorish, the, the Arabs, so the, against the infidel. We can say, in my opinion, that the Portuguese people, they, we were the Knight Templars. Imagine if this was a hotel. <laughs> you, could sleep, you could sleep in the same room as a monk did 900 years ago. Do you find it offensive, the idea of turning this into a hotel? Uh, well, uh, turning turn out this in, into a hotel is not offensive, but it's against our culture and our history. So <laughs> I prefer to keep this like this. It's getting to a point where we have to say goodbye to Ushuel. Not goodbye, No, it's telogu. A telogu. It's amazing how much you can experience in just four days. It's, it's, it's been like, well, it is like having a look. It is a local um, having you around, uh, showing you around, so. No, 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 let's try one more time. <laughs> <laughs> what are you saying? I make a lot of friends with this, uh, with this job, so I'm glad you like it. Yeah. And uh, I think we'll, We'll be spooks here another time. Yeah, okay, thank you. Thank so you. Much. Uh, abrazo. Abrazo, my friend. I've been seeing you. I've been seeing you. I've been seeing you. I've been seeing you. I'm from Lithuania. Lithuania. Okay, okay. Well, that's, that's far from here. Four days of epic uh, adventure and so many experiences that we will never forget from. And so many people that we will never forget. As you know, this was made possible with Sacros Vacation, which we are terribly proud to, to work with. If you want to go on a trip like this as well. A customized trip, you know, a trip that is made for you. This is one of the only companies in Portugal that actually offers uh, them. And, you know, having a guy like Joel who drives you around, explain everything to you. It doesn't and, get more authentic. Yeah, and it, it, it's like being a local when you explore the true Portugal. So there's nothing more to say really than uh, goodbye and thanks for watching. And um, we will probably do more of these adventures. I hope so. Yeah. I want to do more of these. Obrigado por ver o vídeo. Até logo. Até logo.